Better be like ridiculously fucking rich after I uh, sell all this random crap I dig up. Dead end. What? Oh. Somewhere from over here was... Where I was supposed to have come from. What's this? Sunset House. Okay. Yeah. So that's like the graveyard up there. Okay. Now I somewhat have an idea of how I was supposed to get over to the place. Just my gold trail was like screwed up and not showing me the right way to go. Cost very much. Something I noticed earlier in the game was I looked on the map. I look in the sanctuary shop. I'm quite certain there is something new in there. I don't know what the fuck he means by the sanctuary shop. 
I originally thought he meant it was the gifts thing, I've which were here. All of the gifts. But he's been saying that since I ran out of uh, gifts or whatever. So, anyways, what I noticed like a long time ago was if you go over something like this weapon shop, it's like 54,000 gold. It's like, wow, I only have 3,000 gold right now, I'm way far away. But apparently this house is like much, much cheaper. If you can call it a house. <laughs> <clears throat> it belongs to Iris the Stall Vendor, so that means there must be shops around here somewhere. So we'll check these. Treasure? Where? Another emerald. Melee skills. So is this a shop? Yes it is. Nature tattoo set. Might as well buy it all. Heard any interesting news lately? So if that tiny thing was a shop, I'm really gonna have to uh, check all these little buildings. of tea, sack of potatoes, if things get any worse, I'll have to close down, and this will become a ghost town, so this cost, 6,000, interesting, I wouldn't really want to buy property out here, Potion, tofu, carrot. What the hell am I going to do with those? How do I sell stuff? It seems like I have to find a, a, a pawn shop to sell stuff. Because I saw something about a pawn shop earlier. But I haven't seen one in a while. I think I've been to that one. This place is just a mess. So we got the sewers out here. How's this guy? But I should check down here first then. Whoops. Another emerald. I wonder if we're going to get like some cinematic intro to Bowerstone.
because that was like the main town in Fable 2. We've descended into the chasms of the netherworld, stared death in the face, and waded through things so foul I'd rather not think about them. But this is where it gets really ugly. And buried somewhere beneath it all are the people Logan has left behind. page. Remember something about a beard. I don't know what the hell that is. You can see for yourself what life yeah. outside the castle is like. right there. Poverty, hunger, disease. Probably have to find a way around. Wouldn't you want to rebel against it all? 